welcome to another heavy metal diecast video uh, today's bad boy we've got here is the Hawkeye Sea Fury the FB 11 um, this was a, a naval fighter bomber developed during World War II by the British um, company Hawker aircraft it was to be one of the fastest piston engine aircraft to be built but uh, failed into service before the end of World War II unfortunately for the for the English um, it was uh, it was to be two years after World War Two before this aircraft would actually enter service with the uh, Royal Navy, um, but it did see some action in uh, the Korean War. Uh, so it did. Uh, it was produced from nineteen forty five to nineteen fifty five, and eight hundred and sixty four aircraft were built in all its variants. So this is by Witty Wings. So what we'll do is we'll open this bad boy up and have a look. It looks to be all pre assembled. It comes with a you know, nice box. It's all. Um, very presentable it's got the a rear window as well so you can see it all before you even take it out of the box so I'll just grab this bad boy out and have a have a good look it's a bit of an unusual aircraft you don't see too many of these available so it's just to take that packet open it's pretty straightforward it comes with a little little stand option there um, it does hopefully uh, might have a little pop out to get it out. Uh, there we go. So this um, what I'll do is I'll move this packet out of the way. Sorry about the noise. And it's got a little pl piece of um, protective plastic there. We'll peel that off so you can have a real, real good look at this uh, beast in all its glory. So it does have a little bit of sort of oily filament. I have noticed some of these die cast have a sort of a weird sort of filament um, oil on them must be from when they are, are produced um, I'm assuming it all just does wipe off but uh, look I've this aircraft is quite presentable this just cost me $50 um, and that was including the postage um, to my door I bought this from an overseas seller on eBay and as I said it's from Witty Wings so it's you know pellet does spin nice and freely it does seem to be very well detailed We'll have a look at some panel lines. Yeah, the detail on it is really nice. It does have a pilot figure in there. The prop, prop is very, very detailed. The blades are all nice and detailed. We'll flip it over and have a look underneath. So it does have some ordnance underneath, some little rockets. And what looks to be fuel tanks. So obviously the... Um, little stand does go in, in there and the stand does look quite easy to assemble but all the landing gear is fixed it comes fully assembled fully fully ready to, to display um you know me i'm wheels down so it's this is ready for me to just chuck straight on the shelf no nothing to do nothing absolutely nothing to do whatsoever so i think overall this is I mean, the build quality is nice. I think it's quite reasonable for a fifty dollar you know item. It's comparable to the quality of Corgi and everything like that, which generally sit around the uh, eighty to one hundred dollar mark uh, for us here in Australia. Um, I don't know if you, you guys get it cheaper over in England or the, or, or America, um, but uh, things do seem to be reasonably dear here in Australia. So, yeah, it's unfortunate. <laughs> But I think uh, overall, this, the build quality of this is very good. So, yeah, I think it's a you know, nice bit of kit. It's a pretty, pretty tough looking unit. Um, as I said, it's the fastest, uh, it was the fast, one of the fastest piston engine aircraft to be developed during World War II. It just didn't get to see action um, prior to the cessation of hostilities. But it did get to see a little bit of action and use during the Korean War in the 50s. So, uh, but yeah. All right, well, I'll leave it at that. It was short and sweet for this one. I'll put it, put it down and well, gently put it down there. I'll zoom in for you a little bit so you can see some detail. But, yeah, that's it. So this is the Hawker Sea Fury FB-11 um, by Witty Wings in 172nd scale. This is the stand, so it's just chuck that on like that. Quite straightforward. It doesn't have any name on the on the front of it or anything like that and straight in that hole and bang done this is the hawker sea fury fb11 in 172nd scale by witty wings 
And uh, as per usual, you know the you know the drill by now. Um, if you've been watching my videos, uh, stay tuned till the end of this uh, video, and I'll chuck up some stills without my sausage fingers in the way. Um, if you can give us a bit of a like, that'd be appreciated, and even subscribe to the channel, that'd be absolutely awesome. All right, guys, well, you have a great rest of your day, and thank you for spending the time with me and watching this video. Cheers.